Ready? All right, this is our compost latrine. Um, right here we've got our vent pipe coming out the rear. Um, it's got to be painted black, but not reflective black. You want to like a um, non-reflective finish so that it absorbs the heat from the sun and causes the, the fumes from down below where the solid and liquid waste are to rise. Uh, we got at the top, we've got it covered with a little bit of uh, mesh up there to keep any bugs that are able to breed down here. Once they try to escape up the top, they'll be caught and die. Um, take care of that. All right, in our back uh, compartment here, we've got two sides. The left over here is to catch the solid waste. The right over here is to catch the liquid waste. Um, you know, when we're ready, we can just flip the door up, take it out, um, and after it's uh, cured and no longer contains uh, harmful chemicals and biological pathogens, and we're able to add it to our compost on the garden. Um, the urine, we just dilute that and add it to the um, to our drip irrigation system. Okay, over here, we've got our door made with our tire hinges. So it just swings here. Um, inside, as you're able to see, we've got a toilet seat there. And that's going to be where the solid waste goes. Over here on the left, we've got a milk... Uh, some kind of jug, I'm not sure what that was, but we just cut it off and that's our urine collection. So those just go into the compartments down below, we pull them out from the back. Each time uh, someone uses the liquid uh, urine, they'll pour a little bit of water to dilute it. Anytime they use a solid, they'll take a spoonful of uh, this material right here, which is a combination of ash and just plain dirt, and also some straw um, in order to uh, facilitate the uh, decomposition of the solid material. And the vet mesh is to keep all the insects out. Great.